to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Now, Brenda, this is for 32,000 and you still have all three lifelines. Are you ready to continue? I'm ready. Question 10, which of the following landlocked countries is entirely contained within another country? Is it A, Lesotho, B, Burkina Faso, C, Mongolia, or D, Luxembourg? Time starts now. Oh gosh, I'm really not sure. Remember, you can still phone a friend, ask the audience, or do a 50-50. Okay, I'll phone a friend. Who would you like to call? I'll call my godfather. He's good at trivia. Calling the godfather now. Wait, who? Don Corleone speaking. Hi, Don Corleone. We have Brenda on the line here for you. She'd like your help on a question for 32000 I see. Wait, no, I meant my godfather. I don't know this person. We've known each other for many years, Brenda. Yet, this is the first time you've come to me for counsel. Never even invited me into your home for a cup of coffee. And now you say, Don Corleone, I need your help on a trivia question. You have no respect for me or my friendship. Sorry, I think there's been a mistake. I meant to call- You call it a mistake. I call it justice. I've told you many times, Brenda, life is a rubber band. You can only stretch it so far before it comes back and slaps you in the face. Or perhaps you forgot that when your father passed away and you rejoiced at the sight of his will. Wait, what? My dad is alive. He's in the audience. In flesh, maybe. But in spirit, dead. A life that lacks respect is no life at all. So, what's it going to be, Brenda? I'm sorry, why was Don Corleone from the Godfather trilogy on the phone? And why does he think he knows me? Is it Lesotho, Burkina Faso, Mongolia, or Luxembourg? I mean, I still have no idea. I learned nothing from that call. Would you like to ask the audience? You still have three minutes. Okay. Members of the audience, please submit your answers. Counting now. Okay, the results are in. We have 30% for A, Lesotho, 33% for B, Burkina Faso, 10% for C, Mongolia, 26% for D, Luxembourg, and 1% for E, Betrayal. What? Betrayal, Brenda. I would think you'd have heard of it. You're here? Yes, I'm here. Much unlike you when your daughter was born and my wife was forced to care for her because of your untimely abandonment. We showered her with riches, Brenda. But let's be frank, you never wanted friendship. You were afraid to be in my debt. What are you talking about? I don't have a child. I'm 25. And yet, your husband stayed with you, despite your inability to produce for him a son. I'm a lesbian. A lesbian to dishonesty. One minute left, Brenda. Lesotho, Burkina Faso, Mongolia, Luxembourg, or betrayal? Well, betrayal is clearly not an answer. I don't know how this guy hacked your polling system, but I actually need help on this question. Would you like to do 50-50? Fine, 50-50. All right, we now cut it down to two options, one of which is correct. Your options are A, Lesotho, or B, Marlon Brando. Marlon what? Is that a country? Marlon Brando, Brenda. Two-time Oscar winner for Best Actor, Hollywood legend and civil rights activist at large, or perhaps you've forgotten. What are you talking about? If you're not gonna help me, then leave. 10 seconds, Brenda. I have no intention of helping someone who denies the authority of the one who made her. So I give you one last chance, Brenda. In what year did Marlon Brando appear as Paul in Bernardo Bertolucci's The Last Tango in Paris? I don't know what that is. Then I must encourage you to seek help elsewhere. Time's up. Oh, I'm sorry, Brenda. The 32,000 is gone and you go home with nothing. But I hardly had a chance to respond. The answer to which landlocked country is entirely contained within another country is- Entirely contained landlocked country by Brenda. You should have said so. The answer is Lesotho. That is correct, Don Corleone. Well, Brenda, not all contestants go home with cash, but they all leave having learned something. What did you learn today? 
nothing about anything. This entire experience felt like a stream of consciousness. Aww. Well, see you next time, folks.